when I started finding pieces that were appropriate for the Emeralds Quartet's uh, themes project, I created a, a set list called Emeralds Moods and just started throwing pieces in there that looked like they would be good candidates for this. But the problem is that uh, that doesn't tell me which of the different themes each of these is. And um, I don't want to change the title to, to include that. Uh, and so what I did instead was I went back and created a uh, set list um, folder. Um, and I'll show you how to do that in a moment. And in that folder, I put individual set lists for the various themes that I've come up with. Um, so there's the joy of love, there's the pain of love, there's war and hunting. I will have one hunting piece, uh, the Ravenscroft. Um, and uh, so we may, you know, simplify that or not. Uh, there's faith, simple joy, and just plain pain. I have one in that category, uh, like as the doleful dove. Um, a jolly little tune. Uh, so, um, so in each of these, I have the pieces that are appropriate for that particular uh, theme. And you can see I have four in uh, the first one and ten in the second. Uh, no surprise there, etc. So, uh, to do this, what you do is you go back to your set lists menu, and then you click Edit, which is an odd thing. I don't know why that's what it is, but and then you, there's this plus sign on the little folder up in the upper right and you click on that and I'm going to call this uh, y, 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 y. Um, so I create a new folder I called it actually Amaryllis Themes but I'm going to create this new one so now that's way down at the bottom here and that folder contains no set lists click on um, actually I'm going to have to click done now in the top now I open up this set list folder and I can click the plus sign and create a new set list. So let's call this, oh, that's the set list called, oh. And now I'm in that, I'm gonna back out of it with the arrow, and you can see that I have that set list, I can create another one with a plus sign, and I can just create as many set lists as I want in there. And then, um, and I'm gonna, when I stop this video, I'm gonna delete all that stuff, but um, so right now I'm just gonna go back to, uh, where am I, scroll back up, and go into here. Um, actually, I'm going to go back to my Amaryllis Moods. And let's say I want to put J. Pria Moore uh, into one of those. Uh, if I go to the metadata, um, you can see right here I've got all of those set lists. And so I can just click on that and add that to the Love Joy one if that's where it belongs. So, uh, and of course you can do that. You don't have to actually open it up. Remember, you can you can click on the um, circled um, arrow. So if I click on that, it takes me right into that, and I can just add that like that. And I don't know that that's what that where that belongs, so I'm not going to put it there. And then you can do the arrow back again, and so you can just quickly go through and put all the appropriate pieces in the appropriate set lists. There you go. That's how you do that.